friends, Miss Carrie here from the West Haven Public Library, and welcome to the Pet Ghost How-To Video. Let's go over your Pet Ghost kit that you received from the library. You should have a jar with a lid, a tea light candle, some gauze, a styrofoam ball, a glue stick, two glow sticks, two googly eyes, some green spider web, and two decorative sheets. You're also going to need some scissors for this project, and you can also use some markers or colored pencils if you'd like, but that's optional. All right, now that we've gone over all our supplies, let's get started. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is build our pet ghost. So you'll need your gauze, and you'll need your little styrofoam ball and you'll need your googly eyes and some scissors and your glue. So the first thing you're going to do is stretch your gauze to give your ghost some shape, just to stretch it out and just make it look flowy and ghost-like. And see, it's already starting to look like a ghost. If you'd like, you can use your scissors to cut the edges a little bit. You can make a little rounded edge if you want. Or you can make a jagged edge. Or you can just leave it the way it is, whatever you prefer. I'm just going to make my edges a little bit rounded. And there we go. I'm just going to stretch it a little more. And then you're going to take your gauze and just place it over the styrofoam ball. And you can see starting to look like a ghost. There we go. And now if you'd like, you can glue on the googly eyes, or if you have a marker or a pen, you can draw your own eyes or your own face. So I'm going to glue some googly eyes on my ghost today. Oops. And there's my ghost. So I'm just gonna put this to the side for a few minutes and let it dry. While our ghost is drying, we can start decorating our jar. You can take these decorative sheets and turn these frames into windows simply by cutting the center out and gluing them onto the jar. You probably can fit two windows on each jar if you'd like. You can also use these really fun vintage looking labels and you can write your ghost name on them or a fun and spooky Halloween message. I think I'm going to use this frame today, so I'll cut it out. Okay, so my labels and my window are all set on my jar. Next, I'm ready to start getting the spider web ready. So I'm just going to put this to the side. And this spider web's really fun. I think I'm going to take a little bit of it and just put it in my jar and make it a nice little bed for my ghost so he's nice and cozy. And you can also have fun with this spider web and just very slowly and gently stretch it out. So it has a real spider webby look and feel to it. And then you can add this to the outside of your jar or put it around your jar just so that it looks really spooky. Next, we're going to add some lighting to our jars. So each of you has a little battery operated tea light and you can just turn that on. There's a little switch on the bottom and that will flicker. You can place that in the bottom of your jar. And each of you also has some of these little mini glow sticks. Now these won't last very long. Once you activate them, they're only gonna last me for a few hours. So if you wanna use it, what you do is you just bend it until you hear a little snapping sound and then you shake it and then you see there's a little bit of glowing light inside. So if you like that glow stick effect, you can always get more glow sticks at the dollar store, and you can also place these in the bottom of your jar. Once you've added light to your jar, 
It's time to place your pet ghost in their brand new home. I'm sure they'll be very comfy and cozy. Two things to remember about having a pet ghost. You may want to leave the jar lid a little loosened at night because they do love to float around. And they also love Halloween treats. Be sure to leave them something special on Halloween night. They love chocolate, by the way. Okay, my friends, that's it for our pet ghost program. I hope that you had a spectacular time making your pet ghost and its spooky home. And I wish all of you a very happy and healthy and safe Halloween. See you soon.